guys, what's up? Welcome back. So today I'm here to do a little PR haul and it's actually not so little, it's kind of ginormous. Like the amount of packages behind me and in front of me is literally insane. I just want to say thank you so much to each and every one of the brands who send me packages. I'm seriously so grateful and I'm thankful to each one of you as well because without you guys watching and supporting my videos and always commenting and liking and chit chatting with me, none of this would be possible. So thank you to everyone so, so much. Now let's jump right in because there's a lot of stuff to go through. So I might have cheated just a little bit and I already opened this package yesterday because when it came in, I literally started bawling my eyes out when I saw who it was from. And I've actually seen a few other girls unbox this on Snapchat already. This is from A Drunk Elephant and it came in this super nice white lacquered box with this adorable wrapping paper on it. I cannot say how thankful I am. I am obsessed with Drunk Elephant. You guys know I've been raving about their Lala Retro Whipped Cream forever. It seriously has saved my skin the past few months. Like I cannot say enough good things about it. And you guys, this package is literally insane like besides being like the cutest wrap thing ever like I don't even think it matters what I get for Christmas or Hanukkah at this point like this is going to be my favorite thing I've probably ever gotten I'm totally going to have to keep this box because I love how pretty and sleek this is and this thing is so heavy so I'm actually going to put it down to finish opening it but oh my goodness there it literally looks like the entire line of products is in here there's so much stuff like you guys see holy moly and the first thing I see in here is my favorite product ever, which is their Lala Retro Whipped Cream Moisturizer. I am obsessed. And there's also their Virgin Marula Facial Oil. I've actually been mixing this with the Lala Retro lately. It is the most amazing combination if you have dry skin, and especially in these winter months. Like, this little combination right here is my holy grail lately. Like, even for someone who normally has oily skin, my skin has been so, so dry. These are the only two products that have, like, made it any better. Like, they just make my face feel so, so soft. And then this is their C Firm Day Serum. I haven't tried this yet, but I've heard it's really good. Then there's also the TLC Glycolic Night Serum. This everybody raves about. I actually bought this myself a while ago and then I completely forgot that I had it because I accidentally like tossed it in a drawer and just never found it again. Um, but it resurfaced the other day when I was reorganizing. So now I have a backup. So thank you so much to Drunk Elephant. And then this is their Umbra Sheer Physical Daily Defense. So it has SPF 30 in it, sunflower shoot extract, raspberry seed oil. Ooh. Okay, so I'm not normally a huge fan of SPF because of the smell, but this actually sounds like it might smell really good. And then there's also their Be Hydra Intensive Hydration Gel. Again, this is like one of their cult classics. And then TLC Sucari Baby Facial. I haven't tried this, but I've been dying to because lately I feel like everybody's been raving about it. So I'm probably going to include this in an upcoming skincare routine. These are the PK, I think it's called, and the Juju Bar. Um, I think this one is made with blueberry extract, and then this one is made with bamboo. They're little like soap bars for your face. These are perfect for traveling or just keeping on your counter. And their eye serum, girl, my eyes, like my under eyes especially, have been on another level lately. So this is perfect. And then last but not least, oh, oh I didn't even know they made lip balm. Okay, so this is their lippy balm. It's called mongongo nut oil i totally probably just butchered that but yes i actually might open this and use this right now look how stinking cute this package is it looks like a giant nars palette this is way too cute to throw away i'm gonna have to like empty it and then display it in my beauty room because this would be a really cute like piece just display it says introducing our new longwear to strongwear natural radiant foundation available in 33 shades it's supposed to be a 16 hour fade resistant and full power radiance formula Ooh, okay, available December 14th at NARS Boutiques and the website, and then available December 26th at Sephora.com. This is so neat. Okay, so when you open this up inside, they actually had, it looks, um, the makeup artist who works for NARS picked out three shades that they thought would fit my skin best. But then they also sent us the entire range of colors, so all 33 shades in these cute little glass bottles. So if these ones don't work out, you have everything to try. Some of these would also like the darker ones. I feel like I could use these for contouring as well. And then just kind of pass them out to any of my friends who want to try these as well. This is insane. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, NARS. I think what I'm going to do with this one is actually do a full kind of review, wear test slash demo on this foundation. Kind of do a whole video focused around it. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And just thank you so much, NARS. This package is honestly just insane. So next up we have some Urban Decay. They sent over their all-nighter long-lasting makeup setting spray. I've actually used this before. I'm a huge fan of it. It's just a great like everyday general setting spray. It just kind of really locks everything in place. And to me this one actually helps to kind of like melt your makeup together so your face looks a little bit more airbrushed if that makes sense. Urban Decay also sent over their new distortion palette. I have been dying to try this. So this is what the palette itself looks like and in here 
You get 10 different shadows on the bottom and then the top row is five transformer shades that you can either wear these by themselves or you can layer them over the other colors to kind of change them into different shades and different hues. That is such a neat idea. Okay, let's try this out. I'm gonna do two different colors. I'm gonna do purples because you guys know purple is my Jimmy Jam. Okay, so this is what they look like by themselves. This is the two different purple colors. And then I'm gonna layer, what are these colors? Let's put Mind Game and blur over them. And those are two of the transformer shades. That is so neat. And you can kind of mix and match what transformers you put over what colors to kind of change the hues. Like some of these are purple, some of them are green, there's blues, yellows. But this is what they look like with the transformers over them. It almost makes them like holographic and chromey looking. Um, so definitely recommend that one. And then they also sent over, I think these are their new concealers. They're all nighter concealers. You guys know I am addicted to all nighter foundation. It's actually what I'm wearing today. It is like my holy grail full coverage foundation. It just looks so nice on the skin and I love the shades that it comes in. Let me pull this open. There's literally packaging and boxes all around me already. So it says all nighter waterproof. Well, I didn't know it was waterproof. Full coverage concealer. And this one I believe comes in 14 shades. 4, 8, 12, 13, yeah, 14 different shades, and here's what they all look like. And then this is what the package looks like right here. How stinking cute is that packaging? Let's open this bad boy up. Oh my goodness. Okay, so they sent us all 14 shades. It blends out super nice, even just with my finger. That is really, really nice. Thank you so, so much, Urban Decay. This is so, so generous, and I am just... You guys know I'm obsessed with Urban Decay. I literally talk about it all the time. They are one of my favorite brands. Next up is this really cute package from, I think it's Naya Skincare, and it stands for Not Into Aging. They actually contacted me a couple weeks ago and asked if they could send some stuff over, and I said, of course, because I love trying new skincare. And honestly, okay, so I've, I'm obviously only 28. I don't think that's super old, at least not to me. However, I do feel like it's a lot easier to prevent aging than it is to treat it. So I've actually already been starting with some anti-aging skincare, so this is perfect. Now in here, it looks like there is a fully charged serum and moisturizer. The patented EdIA-114 Science fights lifestyle stressors to give you healthy looking glowing skin. The packaging on these is super pretty. And then it looks like there's also, what is this? A glow on demand energizing illuminator. Ooh, that sounds fun. I love the purple on like all their packaging. This is super pretty. Um, this one looks like a cleanser, a wash and glow hydrating cleansing foam. Excited to try that one. Oh, okay, so this is a, it's called Sunday Detox. It is a whipped clay peel off mask. I have literally never heard of a whipped mask or a peel off clay one. So this sounds super interesting. I'm excited to play with this. Thank you so much, Naya. This is the cutest package ever. So this next one is from Becca Cosmetics and I actually already opened it because I wanted to use it in a tutorial I did for you guys. I will link that down below if you guys are interested in seeing it. But this is their Gradient Glow Highlighter, and in here you get five different shades of their highlighters. You get Moonstone, Opal, Rose Gold, Topaz, and Bronzed Amber. And what's really neat is you can either use them individually, like just by swiping your brush through one color at a time, or you can kind of mix and match or do what I do, which is just kind of run my brush through the whole thing, kind of swirl them together, and then apply it. It's just so stinking pretty. You guys will see in the tutorial, I'll show you how, to, how I kind of used it and applied it. But thank you so much to Becca for sending this over. Okay, number one, look at this packaging. How beautiful is that? I love holiday packaging. Like, oh, I'm such a sucker for packaging in general. Look how cute. Okay, so he opens up like this. He's another really cute one I'm going to have to display in my room. Uh oh, he's a little broken. Okay, so this one is Stellar Light, and this one's in the color Peach Gold. He looked like he might have had a little bit of an accident, but it's totally okay. I can probably press him back into place. Um, there's also Gilded Light. Light Gold, Celestial Light, which is a luminous pearl, and Lunar Bronze, which is a rose-colored bronze. Ooh, okay, let's swatch, let's swatch a rose bronze, because y'all know I love me a good rose gold color. This is so pretty. Look how gorgeous these are. It's almost like a gemstone kind of pressed thing. Let's see. You guys, so pretty. Look how gorgeous that is. That's probably one of the most pigmented drugstore highlighters I've ever tried. Okay, let's do one more. Cause these are, let's try light gold because this one's kind of calling the name. These are so pretty. And Pop Beauty is really affordable. I would definitely consider it drugstore pricing. So anything that's affordable, you've got to love, especially when it's super high quality like these. Oh my goodness. You guys. Okay, so this one's the Gilded Gold. Look 
how pretty. Like, you see that? The camera, I feel like, isn't even doing it justice. Like, oh my goodness. Yes. Thank you so much, Pop Beauty. These are amazing. And you guys know Estee Lauder Double Wear was like my first love when it comes to foundation. So they were nice enough to send over a new one for me because I ran out of mine. This one is in the color 1 and 2, which is the color Ecru. This foundation is just, he is like my OG homie. We have been rocking it since back in the day. And even lately, even though my skin's been a little bit drier, this is a very matte foundation, I've been loving mixing this with kind of luminizing products and my moisturizer to give me that really full coverage effect, but still kind of having that nice glow to my skin and still keeping it hydrated. Thank you so much to Estee Lauder for sending this over. I love holiday themed stuff. Okay, so this is from the Wet Brush. This is their detangler. Um, this one's like a sparkly lilac color. How pretty is that? And I seriously... I have wet brushes all over my house, all over my office, all over my car because they're the only brush that I ever use. If you guys have been watching me for any length of time, you guys know I rave about these all the time. This one is freaking adorable. This one is just a mini one, but it has like this really gorgeous snowflake pattern on it for the holidays. How cute is that? Thank you so much, wet brush. These are, oh, you guys, wet brushes I've literally been using for years and years. I cannot tell you how many I bought because I just love them so much. So for them to actually send me products is just the coolest thing ever. And I'm so, so thankful. So this next package is from Benefit as part of their Club Pink program. Now, if you guys do not know what Club Pink is, Benefit chose 200 smaller influencers from all over. And I was lucky enough to be chosen, which I am so thankful for. Benefit is one of my all-time favorite brands I own so many of their products so for them to actually choose me and want to work with me is such an honor and i'm so grateful so thank you to benefit and thank you to all of you guys for supporting me i know he's showing so much love on all of my benefit posts now let's open this bad boy up so much stuff in here do you see like i'm afraid i'm gonna have like an epic fail any minute here i can feel it. they're all gonna come tumbling up look how many things they put in here like this is insane there's brow pencils there's brow powder professional which i always love um a hula contouring stick which i have been dying to try they included some of their liquid highlighters in sunbeam and high beam their real mascara my favorite oof, oof brow pencil and my precisely my brow the precisely my brow is like my addiction this paired with the what's this one called this one is the foolproof brow powder this little combination right here is like my match made in heaven lately. I cannot live without them for my brows. They also included the high brow pencil, the Bravo conditioning primer. Holy crap, they gave us like all of their box powders. So there's Dandelion, Hula, California. This blush is like my obsession. Dandelion Twinkle, Rockateur. Oh my goodness. There's a What's Up highlighter in here. Cabrow, yes please. Roller Lash, Bravo conditioning primer. This is insane. Thank you so much, Benefit. This is honestly the most generous package of life. We've got a little pixie right here. Ooh, it looks like a present. You guys. I feel like this is going to blind the camera, so I apologize in advance. Look how gorgeous this is. Let's open this bad boy up. Are you kidding me? You guys, it is like a life-size giant glow tonic personalized with my name on it. It says Nicole's Glow Tonic. How stinking sweet is that? Thank you so much, Pixie. Oh my gosh, Ole Henriksen sent me fuzzy socks. I am addicted to them. I wear fuzzy socks every single night and every time I put them on, my husband looks at me, he goes, wow, babe, those are super sexy. And I'm like, I know, right? But they sent over little polar bear ones. How cute are these? I'm wearing these tonight. Okay, and then they also sent over a giant, giant bottle of their Truth Serum. It is a collagen-boosted True C Complex Facial Serum. I've never tried this before, but my sister loves it. She always asks for it for her Christmas and her birthday. So thank you so much to Ole Henriksen for sending this over. I cannot wait to try it. So much skincare. Okay, so this one is from Derma E. This one is their Hydrating Night Cream with Hyaluronic Acid. And then their hydrating cleanser, which I desperately need because like I said, my skin has been so super dry. I love their new packaging. I think it's so, so pretty. I'll definitely be trying these out and using them either on my IG stories or Snapchat or in an upcoming skincare routine. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And thank you so much to Derma E for sending these over. They are such a great affordable skincare line if you guys haven't tried them out. Their charcoal mask is also insanely amazing. So Kevin Aquan sent over their new Electro Pop Pro eyeshadow palette. Look how gorgeous the packaging is on this number one. Those colors. Oh my goodness. And then let's see the palette itself. The palette itself has this really gorgeous like rainbow writing on it. That's super cute. 
And you guys, these colors. Oh my goodness. I love me some metal eyeshadows. Look how pretty those are. Can you guys see that? Okay, definitely going to do a whole tutorial just focused on this palette. Maybe several tutorials because OMG. Okay, so this is what the swatches look like. Like, oh, how? Like, how? Those are so pretty. No base, no primer, no nothing. That's just swatches. That is insane. Look how pretty all these colors are. You get blues, teals, greens, purples, pinks. You get some red rust colors. That one looks super fun too. I need another finger. Okay, hold on. We have to do one more swatch. Oh my god. Okay, I don't even know how to describe this color. It's almost like a purpley, mauvey brown, but it is so stinking pretty. Okay, now, okay, definitely have to do multiple tutorials with this because there's just too many different combinations I can do and I'm never going to be able to decide. So make sure you guys keep an eye out for that. And thank you so much to Kevin Aquan. This palette is gorgeous. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Lancome was nice enough to send over three of their ombre hypno sticks. These are so pretty. They're kind of like a cream eyeshadow stick, I guess is how you would describe it. This amethyst purple one right here, it is so gorgeous. That's what I'm wearing in my waterline today. These are so creamy and so pigmented. They blend out like a dream and they are just, ugh. You can wear them by themselves or you can layer them with shadow if you want something a little bit more intense and to make it pop. But by themselves, they're already super pigmented. All I did today was I kind of rubbed it in my waterline and then blended it out downwards with a teeny tiny bit of powder. It was so, so gorgeous. I actually have a full tutorial on this look coming up soon. And then they also sent over their defining mascara, which I use on my kind of lower lashes right here. And because the brush is so tiny and tapered, it is perfect for your lower lashes. Like this is my new favorite lower lash mascara. All right, guys, that's all I have for today. I just want to say thank you one more time to each and every one of these brands who was nice enough to send me something. It's still, it's honestly so surreal to me every time I get a package, like I've bought these brands for years and used their products and to have them actually want to work with me and send me things is just such an honor and a blessing. And I am so grateful and appreciative of it. I obviously want to thank all of you guys too, because when you guys like my videos and you watch them and you comment on them and you like my photos and you guys are honestly just the best and I cannot thank you enough for your support. Now, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what other types of videos you guys want to see. And I will talk to you next time. Bye.